Ambassador, uh, we just learned that despite this is your your first time as an ambassador to Iranian ambassador to Indonesia, but it is not your first Eid in Indonesia. So is it your fourth, right? Am I right? Yes, uh, I was here uh, around 22 years ago as a junior diplomat. I worked in the embassy for more than three years. At that time, I uh, could witness the government of Almarhum Gustur and also uh, President Megawati Sukarno Putri, and after that, SBE, uh, Susilo Banga, and Yudio Noso. During a short period of time, I, I could see here three presidents. And uh, it was very uh, fantastic and very pleasant uh, mission for me to work in Indonesia. Yesterday, someone asked me, what do you enjoy in Indonesia the most? I told them the most pleasant uh, part of the Indonesia is the kind and good people. They are always positive, they are always uh, smiling, and they are always uh, helping. So uh, I like, I love Indonesian people, and I am so happy that for the second time I came back to Indonesia. And to be honest with you, I know Indonesia as my second home. When I am in Indonesia, I miss Iran, and when I am in Iran, I miss <laughs> Indonesia. So I don't know what to do with, with this, you know, double love. <laughs> uh, but when, when you come back to Iran, what 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 are the things that you miss the most from Indonesia? Uh, as I mentioned, uh, good people. Because uh, for the food, I can experience in Iran as well. My wife is a good cook, so she prepares every week during the last 20 years. Every week we had at least one meal a week, uh, Indonesian food. At least once. May I know? What are the main? Yeah, usually sometimes nasi goreng huh? or mi goreng or satay, but <laughs> always we have that. Or is it, or even bahwan? Bahwan. Yeah, bahwan. Ah, uh, we love we love that in the home. My my, my children love the, <laughs> the foods, but we can experience that in uh, experience that in Iran as well. Even when I was in other countries, I was in China for five years, and every week we had Indonesian dish, <laughs> you know, but. Uh, also, the traffic jam and also the pollution I can experience in Iran as well. Uh, <laughs> but, but the which one is the which one is better? The worst. Oh. No, which, <laughs> both of them are the same. I I I assure you that uh, about the pollution, about the traffic jam, uh, it's the same with Tehran. We don't have any differences, so I can experience that in Tehran as well. I don't miss the traffic jam here. But but, but uh, about the People, it's very, uh, I, I, I miss them a lot. When I am in Iran, I miss the good Indonesian people. I uh, just tell you that I love my Indonesian people. I say my Indonesian people because I know Indonesia as my second home. Uh, okay, I will start from this. I believe that Iranian people are also good. But yeah, okay, Iranian people is good, Indonesian people are good. Uh, but again, I will try to follow up just like, uh, what kind of goodness, the, the, the unique trait of Indonesian goodness, <laughs> Indonesian people that you cannot find it in Iran? Okay, that's a tough question, you know. <laughs> it's very difficult to say because you say you cannot find it in Iran. But it's uh, the positive, positiveness and a smiling that Indonesian people are. Iranians are not so positive and smiling. Uh, they are, they are kind. They are uh, very. Uh, uh, the hospitality is very good in Indonesia and Iran. But you can see in Indonesia when you just face some Indonesian people, always they are smiling to your face, and always they say positive words. And I have, I, you know, I, I know a little bit Indonesian language. I can say that. In Indonesian language, it's nice that they they don't say no, they don't say tida, they always say bloom. So oh, it yeah. means that when you ask someone, have you uh, just got your diploma? Uh, they don't say no, they say bloom. It means that I am still trying, I am yeah, still positive. Yeah, yeah. That's the good thing about Indonesian people. Mm. Yeah, yeah, we will not give up. Uh, are there any 
the the very big i mean just like yeah just like you already said that uh, about mudik just like the homecoming trip do you uh, does iranian people also did that during the big feast like the ramadan eat they go home to the their hometown yes uh, in iran we have two kind of eats one of them is nowruz that iranian uh, according to iranian calendar is the eve of the new year so iranian used to go to their homelands during Nowruz, sometimes for one week or two weeks, they go, they take off and go for homes, uh, maybe hometown and come back. Also, uh, during uh, Eid al-Fitri, we have two, offic two days uh, official holiday, uh, but you know that the people uh, like to make this a uh, long term ho holiday, so they take off from their jobs and they sometimes make it one week or oh. even more than that to go home and come back. So yes, we celebrate Eid al-Fitri in Iran very well as well.